This was the flight path hurricane hunters took to gather data on Hurricane Laura this morning. These brave scientists take several passes through the storm, dropping weather measuring instruments in order to analyze all parts of the system. Here's the team preparing the instruments before flight today. But have you ever wondered how they do it without the plane falling out of the sky? Well, it all has to do with how hurricanes are structured. These storms are made up of layers and layers of thunderstorms. And while they can present potentially dangerous vertical turbulence in some of the storms, most of the turbulence actually comes from horizontal winds of the hurricane, which are far easier to fly through. In some cases, strong symmetrical hurricanes with extreme horizontal winds can actually be less turbulent than a weaker tropical storm system that has more vertical thunderstorm activity. As the plane passes through, the weather instruments are dropped into the storm and data about what's going on right now is fed into our models to help predict what the storm will do next. Each piece of information we get is essential in determining the future track and strength of hurricanes. The work hurricane hunters do is invaluable and without them, our ability to track and warn those in the path would be far less effective. And a special thanks to meteorologist Nick Underwood who went hurricane hunting this morning. We thank him for getting that information. And if you want to follow the latest on what he has to say, you can follow him on the Astro Nick on Twitter. Reporting for the StormTrack weather team, I'm meteorologist Luke Victor.